everyone, it's Nona Grace. Today I'm going to make my egg on the bread. So if you're keto, you would leave out the bread, but if you're not keto, you could have the bread and I'm gonna show you how I make it. Okay, now first of all, I had told you in one of my videos that I made myself my own bread. And it's actually one slice. I make a very small loaf. Actually, this one's got one part upside down and one part right side up. Hold on, we'll fix it. You know, I don't, it's not a lot, but it's just enough to say I have some bread. Oh, I see why it's that way, because it's not its mate, but it's close enough. Okay. Anyways, this is the bread, and it's just one slice. If it's homemade bread. And what I will, and what I did is I put it in the freezer. It's thawing. It's almost thawed. So I'm going to make this with my eggs, and I will show you how I do it. I was looking at the camera. Oh dear, that's not how you're supposed to do. You're supposed to look at you. Yes, I'm talking to you about this. <laughs> and I just watched a video again on how to how you're supposed to do your videos. You're supposed to say hi, which I did say my hi. And if you want to see how I make my eggs with my piece of bread, please stick around and we'll show you how. Okay, let's go. These are the eggs that I thought Emma was going to go broody and she never did. But this is how I write all over them. I write a lot on them, so there's no way that could have disappeared. But these were not under her for very long, so they were only under probably an hour or two. So, and it's, they're icy cold outside, so they're still good. Okay, so I'm going to wash my eggs off. Let's see that. This is the oldest. Starts. Wash my eggs off. And I'm going to break them and put them into my pan. You can see how stringy the white is. In a, in a button egg, it's not that stringy. It's more watery. Okay, now when you're, when you're beating the eggs, see how, how the whites are really thick? It takes a lot more to, to loosen them up than a store-bought egg. So I go like this to try to break up the whites because I like the yolk. The best part of the egg is the yolk for me. That's the part I like. Not crazy about the white, so we want to make sure it's all nice and orange. When I use salt, I use the Himalayan salt because the sea salt is good if you don't have, you don't want to use regular table salt. You want to use the Himalayan rather than the sea because the sea's got a lot of um, plastic in it or something in it that shouldn't be there, where the Himalayan is more, more of a pure salt. Okay, we got that pretty good. Now, I put some bacon grease in my pan. I like bacon grease. You can do butter if you like butter. Okay, now I'm going to pour my eggs in. Okay, now I'm going to put my bread in. And I just put a little bit, put some there. Flip it over so I get some egg on both sides. It's like making French toast in the frying pan, but it's not really French toast. I'm going to turn you. Why do you do that? I tip it so that this egg that's on top will start to cook because I don't want to have any raw egg on my, on my bread when I flip it. So this way I get a little more of the egg cooked. It's scrambled egg but not scrambled up. I want it solid. This instead. Now I just kind of flip it over top of the, the egg. 
over the bread. And then I cut down the middle because it's too big for me to flip it. And this way, hopefully it'll cook on the other side. A little bit of the egg that is loose will come out. And this is how I eat an egg, because I really don't care for eggs. I like the bread and eggs part. And since I made my own bread, it's no sugar in it, because I don't like the sugar, the sweetness of it. So it is 2.23 and I'm having my first meal of the day. I was not hungry until just a little bit ago and I thought I might as well show you how I make my eggs because that's what I'm going to have. I just brought in six eggs. Yesterday I got nine eggs so I've got to eat some eggs. I've given two to each of the neighbors and I still have eight dozen in the fridge. And then I put hot sauce on it. And eat it. Use some of Frank's hot sauce. I gotta get the other. I gotta get the big one. As you can see, we use hot sauce here. We have to fill it so I can use it. I'm going to put some on. Most of it has just the egg, like this is all egg, but the bread is right here in the middle. And because that's the part I like, when I get there, it's so good. Okay. <laughs> I never thought you'd see me eat on the camera, but I guess you are. Well, that's the egg sandwich that I talk about when I talk about my egg sandwich. If you want to make an egg, you can do the same thing without the bread. My husband puts cheese in his, or you could put um, some kind of meat inside and fold it over. I find that if I have the bread, I can eat more eggs that way. And then I put the hot sauce on and it makes it really good. Now, I want to tell you, this video I'm hoping gets up, gets Put up tonight. Yesterday's video, well actually this morning's video, was yesterday's video. I made it yesterday. I started around four o'clock and by the time I got it cut down short enough to where my program would load it for me because I have a, I'm using a program that automatically will put it to YouTube and it can only be 15 minutes or less. Otherwise it gives me a hard time. Well, I got the video down to the time it should be and when I went to upload for some reason the computer decided to do an update so it shut everything down and then I did it again and by the time I got it loaded again it told me it was going to be done around one o'clock well something must have happened to the computer in the night and when I got up it was still not loaded so I had to load it again and then it said it, something went wrong again, so for a third time I'm putting it back on. So by the time it actually got put out this morning, it was 9 o'clock or 9 something, it, it finally made it to the YouTube, YouTube channel. But this one I'm hoping goes a lot quicker. It's going to be a lot shorter. So I will talk to you all again tomorrow. Have a great day. Bye.